Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To make advanced changes to a selected image, you can use the Format Picture Task pane within Word 2013 to control every aspect of your picture in detail. For upgrading users, you should note that the Format Picture Task pane now replaces the Format Picture dialog box found in Word 2010 and 2007. The options are very similar, however. The task pane allows for greater freedom of movement and placement of the task pane when working with images in a document. You can display the Format Picture Task pane by clicking the Format Shape Launcher button found in the lower right corner of the Picture Styles button group, located on the Format tab. You can close the Format Picture Task pane by clicking the small X button in the upper right corner. The options that you can change for your selected image are grouped by category within this task pane. You can see the categories shown as icons at the top of the task pane. To use the task pane, click one of the category icons shown at the top and then make any changes to the available settings shown within the collapsible and expandable category groupings. You can click the titles of the category groupings to collapse and expand the settings shown within each. You can then change any settings shown within the expanded groupings. The changes that you make are applied immediately as they are set, so you may need to use the Reset Picture button to reset your image after experimenting with the settings if you do not like them. The next few lessons within this chapter will discuss changing the settings within each category listed within the Format Picture Task pane. When the task pane first appears, it is docked to the right side of the application window. You can move the task pane within Word 2013 by placing your mouse pointer over the title until you see the mouse pointer become a four-pointed arrow. When it looks like that, you can then click and drag the task pane to have it appear floating over the document area if you prefer. You can also click and drag it to the far right and left sides of the application window to dock it to the left or right sides of the screen. You can resize the task pane when it is floating over the document area by placing your mouse pointer over one of the sides of the task pane and then clicking and dragging in the direction shown by the arrows to increase or decrease its size. You can also use the same technique to increase or decrease the width of the task pane when it is docked at the left or right side of the application window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www dot teachyoucomp dot com forward slash free